Hey folks, given the fact that we've already had two videos today, both the morning news this morning and then a couple hours ago, I responded to a couple of experts who were trying to debunk our position on climate change. We are just going to keep this relatively simple and answer one question for tonight's Q&A. The question is, when Earth's magnetic field hits its peak acceleration, exactly how much time do we have? That of course relates to this paper right here, which discusses the fact that at that peak acceleration, Earth's magnetic field is going to be changing a hundred times faster than it is today. When it comes to that, we have two questions. How fast are the magnetic poles moving and how fast is the loss of the magnetic field actually occurring? We already know that the poles have gone from moving maybe a kilometer or two uh, every couple of years to moving a couple tens of kilometers every single year now. And now we also know that we have gone from losing 5% of Earth's magnetic uh, field per century to 5% per decade. So let's accelerate those a little bit. That goes 5% every couple of months, a thousand kilometers a year, if not more. What this suggests is that when that peak acceleration hits, it is pretty much over air travel is going to be nearly impossible. Cosmic radiation is going to be off the charts. GPS is not going to work. The effects on the biosphere from single-celled organisms to plants, even to the most complex machine on the face of the planet will be under significant duress. We are going to see even the tiniest little space weather impacts basically causing havoc with the electric grid. The, uh, with the electric power systems, the power supply. Um, cars will be failing. Phones will be failing. The internet will be failing. And so when we actually hit that acceleration, we probably only have a year or two until the full reversal. But basically, once this point occurs, it is pretty much over, starting within just a couple of weeks to a couple of months. Now, do I know if that's going to be tomorrow? Do I know if that's going to be in 2045? Absolutely not. I do know that the continued weakening of Earth's magnetic field makes every day a higher risk from space weather and galactic cosmic rays, which is why even though I absolutely, I mean, I haven't been lying to you, I absolutely believe in the math that it is going to be somewhere between the late 2030s to 2040s that this event is going to happen. It's why I'm prepping as fast as I possibly can right now. And you should be too. Link to this article is below, by the way. I'll see you in the morning for The Daily Show. Be safe, everyone.